All right, for the food segment, John here is from Buffalo. I spent some major time in Buffalo over the years, and uh, we used to, T-Bone and I used to go to, uh, to the Anchor Bar. Now, you, maybe people don't really realize where the Buffalo Wing originated, but it originated a place called the Anchor Bar, and T-Bone and me used to go there, and they had these things, and we used to say, what are these? And they went, well, we make these chicken wings in the back, and they popular here, and they had just gotten started getting popular when, back in the 70s when we first went there. So uh, we used to get boxes and boxes after the show, you know? Yeah. You get like 15 boxes of them and gobble them down. And then suddenly, uh, people started out of Buffalo, started having buffalo wings all over the country. So John is a cook, uh, and he's our first guest who ever really has cooked on the show. So uh, he's going to make uh, a local favorite, and one of my favorites, going to do some buffalo wings, so show me how to do it, man. Great, okay. So I'm going to reveal like the secret to making like a really crispy buffalo wing, because everywhere else in America, you know. Soggy ones. Soggy. And this is like Bruce Lee. You know, <laughs> revealing the, the, the uh, kung fu yeah, secrets yeah, yeah, yeah. to the to the Westerners. So, um, some guy from Buffalo is going to hit me in the head with a ratchet. <laughs> so, um, but wait, so what we're going to do here is we have we have melted butter. Right? There's nothing healthy in here. And I was and no, no. I told everybody. You know that from the beginning. It's fried food. Right. It's butter. And if you're on Lipitor, you got to double up. Yeah, take two <laughs> Lipitors. Two, two, two Lipitors and an aspirin. And uh, so, so we got butter. We have the chicken wings. Uh, we have some rags because I like to do it this way. I like to uh, take the chicken wings and pat out the extra water because uh, then the temperature of the oil doesn't go down too far and then you get a crispier fry. And then uh, you have the only hot sauce that you can use. There you go. Frank's hot sauce. Frank's Red Hot is the only hot sauce to make wings with. I don't know that anybody else in Buffalo does this, but what I noticed was when you're dumping chicken wings into a fryer, what I do so that they cook faster Squeeze all that water out of Squeeze all that extra water out of there. If you can get fresh ones, that's even better. You know, so we'll put these guys right in here. You know, they don't have to be like, you don't want to kill it so there's no moisture inside there. But the coolest part about this is we're both standing here in leather jackets cooking. <laughs> <laughs> I got an apron on, you know? <laughs> that's, really... that's why I'm not jumping in there. I'm yeah. not going to grease all over myself. <laughs> Give it a shake so they don't stick to the baskets. You want to crisp the outside, sure. which is why the oil is so hot. You know, we, I mean, we're right on the edge of blowing this whole thing up. But that's how everybody in Buffalo lives. <laughs> and, uh, so you said 20 minutes? I would say 18 minutes. 18 sure, sure. minutes. We had a, you, you gotta, you know, do we have a timer? We it's should... okay. If you don't have a timer or anything like that, wait until the wings are floating on top. And then, you know, you take, take a, a, a spatula or, or a pair of tongs and, and tap it. And if it sounds kind of charred, it's done. You know? And then, as you said, you put the, you, you put the oil about as hot as you can do. About as hot as you can do without it yeah, smoking. Sure. And, yeah. Yeah. 